Supercell has introduced a new game mode called Mortar Time. Welcome back citizens, it is I, your king and today I am going to be showing you the mortar game mode that has been snuck into the game by Supercell. Many of you don't know about it, I am pretty sure about that. So today I am going to be covering it so that you know about it and you can play it yourself. And we are underway to 300 subscribers by the end of this month. So please hit the subscribe button right now if you are new to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet. So let's, uh, I will just show it to you guys. As you can see in the friendly battle tab, we have now the mortar time. This is going to last for 22 days so you can play this throughout the season. It is really good. Alright, so hopefully someone, yeah, here we go. So as you can see right in the middle, we have one gigantic, one huge mortar in the middle which has 3800-180 HP. This is basically like the dragon egg challenge where you have to deal damage to put it on our side. So for example, I'll show it to you right now. I go with all of this, so that it will start dealing damage to the mortar. And once the mortar is completely on our side, once we have dealt uh, all the damage that we possibly can, you guys will see something, yeah. Right now, the, ta the mortar will actually start damaging the tower and not anything else. It will only tower. The, it will only target the, uh, the ta tower. Now, I'm not sure if this might come in the game as I said earlier. So, it will be really fun if it actually comes. Whoops, I missed my fireball. But we are not here for that. We are here for checking out the mortar. So, yeah. This is gonna be really fun according to me. Oh my god. Okay, this time let him have it. Just to show you guys how it works. If it is on our side, it's gonna be showing us as blue. But if it goes on their side, it'll automatically turn into red and then it'll start dealing damage. The mortar might look slightly glitched by the fact that it looks on, it's on the other side, but it's actually in the middle. It's just like how it looks. And I would like to give a huge shout out to gamer boy Shahram because he also uploads Clash Royale content, I believe, some uh, Xbox decks and stuff like that. So make sure you check him out if you wish to. Oops. Alright, let's go. Let's play our hunter once again. It is gonna be pretty exciting, uh, this thing, according to me, once again. Because you, you have like so much capabilities to like you have to focus completely on damaging this thing. On capturing the mortar because it's gonna deal a lot of damage as you can see. Per, uh, per hit uh, I believe is the normal just like a uh, uh, normal uh, level 9 mortar. So it's gonna be pretty good. I believe many of you didn't know about this so now you do. Because Supercell didn't announce this that they were gonna put this in they just did it. So yeah. Alright, let's see how this goes. Alright, well played on his part. He pushed away, but I'm gonna take the mortar for sure. And once again, the mortar is gonna lock onto the tower, deal damage. I mean, e uh, it has to lock on without any, like, even if there's something in the middle, it will not target it. It will only target the towers. And I think I should get that tower right there, hopefully. Let's do that, let's do that. Okay, let's try taking the, this thing again. Hopefully, that's okay. Well played on his part, but it's not gonna matter. We're definitely gonna take it, and then the uh, mortar is gonna lock onto the tower, and that should be GG's for us. Easy victory. Okay, so yeah, that's about it. I really hope you enjoyed this video and now you can go and play your, with your friends. Many people have already speculated and speculated that this was gonna come. Jeff, if you're watching this video, thanks for coming out for that. Yeah. Alright then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe for more videos like this and if you have enjoyed, make sure you like the video as well. Until next time, stay safe and remember, be awesome.